Hello fellow crafters and fellow coupon lovers, it's the Florida Crafter and I'm here to share with you my Rite Aid haul from yesterday. Now um, I don't actually have the products here before me. I've tried to upload this video all night long and it just would not upload. So I'm just going to go over my receipt and show you what I got. Got pretty much um, most of the same things that everybody else uh, picked up yesterday. First, I want to give a shout out to Igor, and uh, I'll put his um, YouTube channel in the description box. At first, I, I started out by pretty much going by the video that he did yesterday morning I, with the, um, let's see, one Max Freeze, four hand sanitizers, one Restless Leg Cream, one Sleep Sheets, and uh, seven, seven other Sammy Foams and the Nair. My store didn't have any of the Nair products nor the Sleep Sheets. But anyway, I started out with that as being my base, and then I proceeded from there. So these are the items that I picked up yesterday. Awesome, awesome time. I added the loaf of bread because I was using, I think it, one, last coup, one last up I wanted to use was a $5 up, and I was in the negative. And in order to use that last $5 up, I had to add a couple things. So I added a loaf of bread, and here we go. As to the different things that I picked up, I did pick up two of the microfiber um, cloths that was in a couple of videos, a couple, of, well, maybe a month ago. They were producing art rewards. I never found those. I found them yesterday. They were at 79 cents. They did not produce the um, plus ups, but I just went ahead and kept them because it still was a good deal. I picked up two of the no nonsense socks, uh, which are. A dollar at my store every day thinking that they would produce a three dollar plus up they did not but I kept them anyway because they ended up being free another microfiber bag uh, cloth rather and there's the hand sanitizers there the restless leg cream the max freeze and I also picked up let's see what was it yeah, I picked up um, an olive oil body wash and a facial cleanser. I did I had another one of those coupons, buy one, get one free. And uh, at Rite Aid, what happens is, let's see, the coupon was buy one, get one free. And then at Rite Aid, they buy one, get one 50% off. So it ended up being a good deal. I ended up basically getting both of them free. And there are the Sammy Foams there, the $8.99. And then, uh, let's see, hold on just a second. Let me flip over to the ad since I don't have the product. There's a coupon that I use right there. They're $8.99 minus $6 makes them $2.99. And then I also use the $5 PDF coupon to go along with that. And then also let me flip over to the back of the ad. And there's the advertisement for the Max Freeze. Spend seven, get seven back. Advertisement for the restless leg cream. Spend eleven, get eleven back. There, the there's the um, advertisement for the sleep sheets. As I said, my store didn't have them, but that's what they look like. Spend five, get five back. There's the advertisement for the hand sanitizer. A um, dollar each. You can do it four times per card and get four dollars back. Four one dollar plus ups back. Now uh, it's been reported that the, only the plain if you will is the one that's producing the up rewards so you want to remember that and then let's get back over to my receipt here I picked up two of the 20 ounce Gatorades in the I think it was in the flu book there's a dollar coupon for the 20 ounce four pack etc so I just picked up a couple of those because I knew I was going to have some overage so I let the overage pay for those then we'll just continue to go down so that you can see what I have. Like I said, it's pretty much all the same that everyone else picked up. So I'll just show you my receipt because I did want to share with you what I picked up. And let's see that Neutrogena coup uh, coupon right there. What that is, there's a coupon in here. Let me flip over and get to it. There's a coupon right here for Neutrogena and Cleaning Clean and Clear products. I found uh, clean and clear acne paste on the clearance rack, and it ended up being, I want to say it was like maybe 84 cents or so, but anyway, it was less than a dollar. So I used this coupon on that. Forgot that we had those $1.50 um, clean and clear coupons, but that was okay because it was still free. 
And actually the product that I picked up was a little, let's see, was this item right here. So like I said, I think it was the acne paste is what it's called. So anyway, back to my receipt. Sorry for being all over the place. But like I said, I tried to upload this all night and it would just would not upload. So here we go where all the coupons are coming off here. As you can see, this is $6 there. Oh, 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 stop, hold up, snap. America, look at that. I just noticed that. Now, I picked up two single Gatorades out of the cooler, and you see what happened? Instead of them ringing up at the single price, which, sorry about that ratty nail, which should have been $1.59, they actually rang up $4.31. So I'm thinking what happened is someone must have taken one of the four-pack, six-packs, broke them up, and put them in the cooler, and that's what I got charged for. So I'll be back up there tomorrow so I get that taken care of. And that's on two receipts. So they're going to owe me some more money, money, money. Wow, I just noticed that. So anyway, continuing to go down the receipt. This is where all the coupons start to come off. Come on down here. Now here I picked up some... Um, olive oil and on the at the bottom of my receipt and let me see because I ripped it off but at the bottom of oh here it is right here at the bottom of this receipt you see it says spend 10 on Fantasia products and get a five dollar plus up I didn't know what that was so I went start looking at the products that I picked up and it was some uh, olive oil spray and I apologize I don't remember the name but it wasn't the organic I know that but it's in a green a light uh, lime green can and so they were on clearance for 75 percent off i think they were like 529 is that what it is yeah they were 529 and they were 75 percent off of that so even though they were on clearance they were tracking for the plus up so i picked up i think i picked up four in this transaction and maybe two more in another so i have seven dollars into that deal so when i go back tomorrow i pick up a couple more things or find out what else is um available on the fantasia line and go ahead and get that taken care of so let me go back up here and here there we go okay so now let me come on down picked up a cinnamon roll also to go into um be able to use that last plus up that I was telling you about in the beginning. And that was my snack, snack for the road, road trip back home. And here we are all the way down here. There we are. And my subtotal was $0.23. Cents. Tax was $7.75. Out of pocket, I paid $7.98. But I got $4 in cash back. Because for some reason, that last $5 up still just would not take with adding and taking off, adding and taking off. It would not take. So, what is that down there? I don't know what all that. Uh-oh, 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 sorry about that. So, anyway, so what the uh, manager did was he calculated it and however it ended up being he owed me four dollars in cash back so that was fine with me so now it looks like they're going to owe me even more than that because that's like eight dollars up there for that gatorade so anywho i had a great trip sorry that i'm all over the place and um i had an awesome time so here are the plus ups that i got back as i said i got the four one dollar plus ups for the hand sent right eight hand sanitizer i got the eleven dollar plus up for the which one was it for the restless leg cream wow sorry about that the eleven dollars for the restless leg cream and then i got the seven dollars for the max freeze again i'm sorry that i'm all over the place and then i did another transaction on uh, my second card that has no percentages off but it was pretty much the same thing pretty much a duplicate of the same and on that one let's see here where is it on this one my subtotal was 84 cents tax was 620 pay seven dollars and four cents out of pocket 
one thing that I did want to uh, let you all know is when I was there one day last week, I gave the cashier two plus ups. And as I was reviewing my receipt, I saw that they were had zero beside each one, which meant that the plus up was not a plus ups were not applied. So I took those back yesterday and showed them to the manager. And he said, yes, that happens sometimes. But what he did was he reimbursed me the four dollars in cash. So if you have any of your, any of your receipts and you notice that that happened, uh, go back, talk to your store manager, because like I said, he said that does happen from time to time, but I was reimbursed the $4 for the two $2 plus ups that were not applied to my transactions. Again, I'm sorry that I'm all over the place. And for the second receipt, I got the exact same plus ups as before, four $1 and 11 and a seven. And as always, thanks for stopping by and definitely have a blessed day. Bye.